Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to another episode on Satisfactory. And in today's episode, we are fixing up the screw factory. We are adding more trucks and we are doubling our power capacity. So if you are enjoying this episode at any point in time, please leave a like, subscribe and ring the notification bell. So uh, I'm just going to quickly paint this and be back in a second. We should have indeed have finished all of this off. Um, let me just go upstairs and I'll show you what I've kind of done up here. Um, so as you can see here, I just kind of brought everything up um, to this next level. This was like kind of the best way and these were like kind of the rooms that I could use and then kind of maybe bring them out the side and then send them over to the factory or probably the other way would work a bit better. Um, some of the lines are a bit funky like this because for whatever reason they wouldn't work. Um, the way like I intended them to um, but anyways if you look down here I kind of tidied up that thing like I said I was going to um, it's not really anything exciting it's just uh, conveyable stacks and then I just kind of took, took them over there with a little bridge and stuff like that so yeah it kind of works pretty well and then over there if I need to I can just build a ramp if I ever take cars over that way I can just build a ramp and things and just jump them or even stack them higher and then just go underneath would probably be easier um, but I think down here I messed up um, I'm not sure if you guys saw that I'm not sure if I'm gonna speed it but it's just there I missed one screw just there and then also um, I'm pretty sure uh, this oh god how do I get back okay there we go and then I don't really know how I was gonna like merge them and then um, send them over to like where I need to go like this is what I send it, it intended to do but this here and I was just gonna bring them along one track and then kind of send them down um, to here and then from there they can take what they need sort of thing and then that way I can knock out all of this really um, and then do that but they should be also on this floor coming out here, um, which is, uh, thank you, yeah, so they should all be coming there, so if I flip this system around and bring them coming this way, I can just send them a lot closer to the floor that they need to be on, and then that way I can send half of them down to this floor and then keep half of them onto the next floor, because I'm pretty sure they will need to, um, I don't know if I'm going to make that, I'm going to die. I didn't think I was going to make that. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm pretty sure they will need screws as well for that top tier. I was grabbing stuff and go over there. Whoa, but this looks so much nicer now. I like it. And then I'll also get another bridge coming across, so I think that could look pretty cool as well. Um, where did I? I was so close to it. Thank you. Um, and then also for the power, I have an idea for that as well. So we're going to get onto that first before we do anything with the screws because um, we need more power. I don't, this is not even going to work. Um, can I like just snip you and then you can connect to that and then we can work. Thank you. Because I need to go up the top to have a look. So I can essentially get rid of all this and then just have this... Uh, working more better more better betterly um yeah whatever that is so we got rotors and that's it so reinforced plates and rotors both need screws so if i send like half of my screws here like that's really all that would need screws wouldn't it not these don't these don't they don't no okay so we can send like that bottom level screws to this floor and the top like the top like production half to this way so we'll have like 1400 screws coming in and whether or not we use them all or we can just like kind of overflow method it and then later on if we need some we can just take some from here i feel like that way it could work a lot easier and then we can just get our plate production and just pump all those into plates and things because we don't really need rods anymore i'm pretty sure because we have all because i was just making the rods to make the screws so I don't think we need rods in other recipes, do we? Oh, we do. Okay. So we might still need 
those to make rods for us. Or at least... Yeah, because they're going to need them for both of those as well. So, yeah, that's alright. Um... Because this is, this is doubled, so I can essentially get um, three more out of just this one line. And then I can take some, like, more plates from one of these machines just because I have three of those producing. Um, sorry, I have these ones here producing the plates and these ones over here producing the screws. So, uh, my thing. Um, so I can essentially steal another one of these just to make um, iron plates as well and then have those being sent up because this one is not even being used at the moment either. So yeah, they can double our production so we can have six of those in total, I believe. With, no, we'll have three, six, nine. So we'll have nine making reinforced plates. So how many would that need per minute? It doesn't really matter because we're going to have the exact amount anyways, so that would be fine. And then that way we'll be making 45 reinforced plates per minute. And then 9s, I think we should be fine with that. Let me do a quick calculation. Um, 120 times 9. Yeah, so we still have a spare 800 screws being in this area. Just with that bottom section of ours. So then that would still leave... And that'll be under a thousand, so we'll still have like sixteen hundred screws um, left over. <laughs> May went a bit bit crazy with that, but that's fine. No need to worry. Um, so yeah, power. We need more power because we are very close to killing our system. So I'm pretty sure I can run a lot more of this one thing because if you come over here. See, I just don't understand what the trucks carry because my miner over there is producing 120 a minute. And this here is taking, like this here is full constantly, always. And I have a storage container down there that's full as well. So let me just double check these guys here and we'll see what we can do. Um, because we might have to... Um, so what do we got? Consumes... So, um, I did a quick little, uh, calculation sort of thing, and with the cold node that we have at the moment, it's just, the only way we can do it is if we get Mark III belts. Okay, so we put a Mark II mine on there, we, um, overclock it, it should give us 240, um, anyways, and then if we, if we like, just overclock it once, that'll be giving us more than enough, and then that there will need to Mark, we need the Mark III lines, basically, just to use that one coal node, and don't really want to go set up another thing right now, so, um, as you can see in the top right corner, I have just mentally crafted those, and that wasn't too bad, it didn't take as long as I thought, um, we have everything here, it's just that this is not automatic at the moment, it's, like, I kind of wanted to do, but, I mean, um, we need the power, so, we, we gotta do it, so, yeah, let's just go and hit the button, Milestone reached. Logistics have improved by the means of a container with increased storage capacity and enhanced conveyor belt efficiency. So, in order to do this, we still do need some more of this, and we just need one still, uh, and I presume, yeah, they use those. Okay, let me craft up what we need, and I'll meet you guys over at our call node. Alrighty guys, so we are here, um, we can leave that there, um, now this is where it comes in, I really hope I brought enough of these plates, and I don't know if I did, actually, let me just see if I can replace you without having to, you know, break it and then, um, pick it up again, no, I'm gonna have to do that, that's alright. So if we chuck you down there, we angle you that way. We then add some Mark III belts coming out to there. Upgrade you. Upgrade you. And I didn't bring enough. That's so annoying. But anyways, look at these belts. They look sick. 
Um, we need to bring you back down here, Nee. Bloop. So you should, yeah, be producing as 240 already. That is from a pure node and Mark II miners. So they produce 120 at normally, and being a pure, um, it doubles that, so it goes to 240. Look at that, that is just nuts. So we'll have 240 coming in. Oh my god, is this quick? So what, we need another 10, I think it was, um, to complete it. Um, yeah, so we need 10 of those, and then we probably need another 11. Yes, yeah, so we need 21 more because uh, this is only going to go 120, but we need it to be 270. And then we'll get another truck to come in here, and that should um, make everything work. So I'm going to go um, set this up. Just grab those extra few things that I needed, and then uh, put this truck in, and I'll put the station in over there as well, and we can see how that goes, and then we'll have to figure something else out to do, like where we're we going to bring it, and how we're going to bring it over to the coal station. I could, man, I essentially could do it the same way, I suppose. It wouldn't really hurt. We are underway. I did put the other thing in, no I didn't plug it into power, I don't know if it's going to work or not. It's fine, it should be right, even just so I can sit there anyways and um, do do the thing. This should be fine I think. Try to keep it as even as possible. And then yeah, I think I'm just going to run the uh, new track along where the old one is and just kind of stack it up a little bit. And it should be good. Now we can slow down here, turn in, and that will get no interference if they ever come here at the same time, which I don't think they will. We're going to stop here, unloading, unloading, let's give it a few more minutes just because I'm not sure that should be good, and then we can go up here. And turn a left and drop off. And um, we can bring that to like here because yeah, it's not really ever going to be an issue. We just got to make sure that's unloading. I mean, oop, there we go. And we should see it coming shortly. There it is. Just here. Oh, that lucky I did go under because these are very close. Yeah, cool. Should go up. I'm just hoping that thing here has enough time to refill in between both of those that get done. It should be right there. Bang, 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 bang. Yeah, nice. And is that all you had in there? I did. And now we can essentially do the same thing that we did here. It's kind of just bring it off, wasn't it? Yeah. It's got to boil it down and around. Yeah, let's just do that for reference, anyways. And then we know where center is, and then we can line it up properly, and things will will work well. Okay. Put you that. Delete you. Bring you to there, and then we can do this. Ta da! Okie dokie. This can kind of be this like a little underground storage area. I don't think we will really need it. Um, let's just do this one. Oh, nice. Um, but we can just put you there. I think that's in line. That's not, but that's fine. And then can we send you like this way as well? So if we go something like... That really delete 
this and that this and then if we do a double wall and boom 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 and the coal is coming along nicely and then we're essentially just going to copy this design uh, on the opposite but we're going to do it up a few levels so let's uh, do that right now and then I'll bring you guys back when we have it done so one, two, maybe here actually. Alrighty guys, so we are ready to go basically. So I'm going to have these guys at the very far back end. Hopefully like directly in line with these guys. So that would be the inlet there. So we can put one of yous there. Then hopefully this should help me line it up from there. Kind of just want to go all the way back as almost. I guess that's still too far back. Sorry, mate. And then. that perfecto I think that's pretty much what that had there anyways I'm sure I can just adjust them if I need to but should be fine for the moment and we should just be able to whack 12 of these down and bang and so this should um, keep us uh, going on power for a for a while anyways, at least so we can get this like next year of production done. So we should be able to get all of that um, done there and then be able to start some iron soon enough. Um, once we get these two things here done, can you go under there? There we go. Cool. So you go to there. Wow, did I miscalculate a lot. How many? 33 each and I need 12. What did I only make 21 for? Anyways, let me go down and I'll be right back. Alrighty, so we have everything here done. Let's uh, get you. Come there, I think. Whereabouts will we bring this up? I mean, we could do it there, or we could bring it down. Hmm. I guess we could, being that it is there. We could just keep going straight, so really, what would it be like? There? That's no, probably a bit over. that far so it has to be that one okay so let's hopefully there's I didn't even think of oh god thank you I don't want to die again I've already fallen off this thing like five times but I didn't really think of the uh, conveyor lifts even lifting this high so needs to hope they do um, so we've got three No, we wouldn't even want you that close anyways because you need to uh, have a lift on the end of it. Okay there. Get logistics conveyor belt 3. That is going to be max height if it is working. Let's go have a look. Hopefully it, hopefully it fits. Like, I mean, if it's a little bit lower, it won't really matter too much because we can just lift it straight up and it's not going to do too much. So should be fine, hopefully. Oh, yeah, sweet. It's even too high. That's cool. But we can then grab you. Get from there. Break this line. Break that. And then bring you to that. 
and split into that. And ta-da! It should be working. We should now have 1200 watts of... Yeah, 1200. That's correct, yeah. 1200 megawatts of power. So it's essentially the same thing. We got 120 coming in. Uh, we got 60, 60, 60. Then it should go 30, 30, 15, 15, 15, 15. But it's a little bit like too much um, for like a machine like at the moment. Uh, no connection because it's not making any power. So we have to go to the back. Um, yeah, it's a little bit too much for the machine. So it kind of overflows a little bit. Um, but that's fine. Like I'm not too fussed about that. And there we go, guys. We have the doubled our power source, 1,200 megawatts a minute, a second. I don't know what it is by. I guess a second. I don't know. But that's uh, that there done, and we can now reconnect the rest of our factory. Boom, boom, boom. Everything should be up and running again, and we are yeah using our power because that's all stopped because the things are all full so in the time it took us to finish that it filled up like 12 no 16 containers full of screws so yeah that happened but I might just leave this ladder here um, that's kind of like a little little way to get up there if I ever need to check on anything I don't know if I'll move it though but yeah that could be all we'll do I'm just gonna grab the paint gun real quick and spray this and there we go guys all painted up, all working swimmingly, and uh, yeah, doubled our power. We are making 12,000, no, not 12,000, 1200. Sorry, can I get out of this photo mode? Thank you. So, we're making 1200 megawatts per second. We're currently only using like 200, but that's just because this is going to be annoying. That's because um, we only have. Uh, like not all of our factory running like only parts of that would be running this whole machine here probably has stopped working because it's all full up on screws um so yeah i think that there might wrap up the episode guys i've been going for quite a while i know i said i wanted to get that stuff done but i it's just, we've we've done a lot of progress towards it and yeah i think next episode we'll bring a line from that middle one across and then we'll keep that there for the next tier and things. We doubled our power, so we don't need to worry about that. We have enough um, to keep us going for a while. And we have another truck going. And yeah, I think it's been a pretty productive episode. So if you have enjoyed, please leave a like, um, subscribe, bring the notification bell to be notified for any and all future uploads. And yeah, until next time, guys. Yeah.